Hi, my name is John with Onyx Imaging here in Tulsa, Oklahoma. We are the highest rated printer service center nationwide. If you're interested in learning how to receive free labor on all of your service calls as well as how to qualify for free printer upgrades, contact us today. We are here for all of your printer and office supply needs. Okay, today we're going to show you how to change the drum and reset the drum counter, drum counter on a Brother Intellifax 4100E. It's a pretty simple process. The first thing we're going to do is open the front door here. Remove the toner and drum. Once you have the drum and toner pulled out, you're going to separate the toner from the drum. So you're going to push down. There's a little blue tab on the side of the drum. You'll push down on that, on the toner and lift right out. And set the old drum off to the side. We'll get our new Onyx brand drum. Now inside of every Onyx brand drum, there are written instructions on how to replace the drum. So we, now that we have our new drum, we're going to replace the toner into our new drum. You'll feel it kind of click into place. Once you've installed your toner into your new drum, you're going to want to move this little blue tab to the very top of the drum and slide it all the way across the top about two or three times. Making sure that it ends in the same place it starts. You'll see two little arrows pointing at each other. Now once you've done that, you'll insert your drum and toner back inside your print. We're going to leave the front door open. You're going to press the clear button. It's going to ask you to replace the drum. You're going to press 1 for accept. And after that, you're going to close the front door. And just like that, you're back up in front.